Umbilical cord prolapse is a very dangerous childbirth complication that occurs when the umbilical cord drops or prolapses into the birth canal in front of the baby instead of behind the baby. The reason this is dangerous is that when the cord drops down first, it will get compressed by the baby's head as it enters into the birth canal behind the cord. When the baby's head compresses, the umbilical cord, it can decrease or even completely cut off the baby's maternal oxygen supply during delivery. The umbilical cord is a vital lifeline between mother and baby during pregnancy. The umbilical cord is how the mother delivers oxygen and nutrients to her baby. The baby is entirely dependent on the umbilical cord to breathe inside the womb right up until the moment of birth when they start breathing air on their own. In a normal vaginal delivery, the baby's head enters the birth canal first and the umbilical cord stays behind it and out of the way until the baby comes out. This enables the cord to remain unrestricted and continue to deliver oxygen to the baby during labor and delivery. When umbilical cord prolapse occurs, the cord drops down into the cervical opening and birth canal in front of the baby's head. When the baby starts to get pushed into and through the birth canal behind it, there's no room for the prolapsed umbilical cord. As a result, the baby's head or body ends up squeezing and compressing the umbilical cord against the walls of the birth canal. This compression of the umbilical cord can cut off the baby's oxygen and result in brain injury in a very short time. Umbilical cord prolapse occurs spontaneously and without warning. When umbilical prolapse occurs during delivery, it is a very dangerous obstetrical emergency that usually mandates an immediate emergency C-section. If umbilical cord prolapse is not promptly diagnosed and the baby is not immediately delivered, this complication can have serious consequences.